The day you face your own biggest challenge. The day you either distinguish yourself or fade into the crowd. That's the day this board will be written. You know who I am? Of course, I'm a dominator. It's showtime. The laminating is the final stage of construction and has the biggest bearing on overall strength of the board. It provides required stiffness levels specific to each design. We only use materials that we trust for years of development. The 12K carbon we use as a ribbon technology is a great combination of stiffness and strength. Other materials used are S-Glass and Anegra which provide great durability and toughness. The wetting out of the cloth is carried out on a wet out table. This has heating elements underneath it and allows us good control of the resin into the laminate, giving the best strength to weight ratio. With the slalom, carbon is laid at 0 90 degree to trap a stiff board to transfer the load from the rig directly into speed and allowing better trim and control. The carbon components in the waveboard is laid at 0 to 45 degrees along the centre line, which is in a diagonal pattern, creating more reactive flex for a livelier ride, whereas free rides built for a more comfortable and forgiving ride. Once the cloth has been placed onto the board, a small amount of collodial silicate and resin is spread over to act as a weed filler and prevent drain out. The laminate is trimmed and the corners and offcuts are used as reinforcing patches to reduce waste. Next, peel ply is placed over the board, which when removed after the curing process, takes out excess resin and leaves a finish that is easier to sand. Then off into the vacuum bag and oven for the curing process at 40 degrees times 6 hours. Then it's time to sand and prepare the overlapping areas for the best bond to the bottom laminate. Now a similar process as is used in the deck laminate is used to laminate the bottom of the board. So you've just seen the exterior laminates applied to the board. Um, the next stage we're going to show you is adding the sanding coat and do the final sanding of the board.